Another integral part of the shifting system is your chain. The chain is what interfaces with your chain rings and your cassette, and without proper care of your chain, your shifting system isn't going to work and your drivetrain is going to wear out very quickly. Uh, the most obvious thing to check for is if your chain has any lubrication. To do that, so you normally just simply touch your chain, you should be able to see some grease come off. Um, excessive grease and buildup too is not going to help because it holds dirt inside your chain and that also wears on your chain. So if your chain appears dry or squeaks, or if you've got uh, visible rust on it, you'll definitely want to grab some kind of oil-based lubricant. And to apply the lubricant, just hold it here above the cassette. And as you pedal slowly, apply that lubrication to the entire length of the chain. And once you're done with that, I usually hold a rag right here so it doesn't splatter on your wheel and your braking surface. And go ahead and just pedal backwards quickly a few times. And I'll even come and shift through a few gears just to let that lubrication work its way into the inside of the links of the chain. Now, one thing that people really don't look at is that they don't clean their chain when they're done lubricating it. And that it gives you a very messy, black looking chain. Anytime you touch it, your hands are covered in grease. So what I'll usually tell people to do is to grab a, a rag, hold it in one section and wipe the top and the sides, move to a new section, and continue to do that until you've cleaned the entire part of the chain. You can tell your chain's clean on the outside when you stop seeing a lot of black grease and dirt build up on your rag. And continue to do that until your chain is clean and the lubrication stays inside the chain instead of on the outside where it just collects more grease. Another thing you want to check for is any bent or broken links. Looking at the chain from the top here, you'll be able to see if any links, you know, maybe one, two, or three links are twisted. And when, if that's the case, you'll hear a click every time that section goes through the cassette and down into the jockey wheels. What I recommend people do is just replace one or two links with some brand new links. You can usually get those for free at a bike shop. Or just take a couple links out and, and check if your chain is still the right length, which is covered in the chain section uh, of the video. Having those two things together will help uh, as part of the larger shifting system to give you great shifts.